What's up, YouTube, and thank you for tuning in to the first official episode of Ryan Sly TV. My name is Two for T, and right behind me is my 1986 Nissan S12. And the engine inside of my car right now is from my S13. And as you can see, I've been trying to make this engine run. And there's a couple of reasons to why it's not running. When I purchased the car off of Craigslist, in the description in Craigslist, you know, the seller said that it had a KA in it. You know, I purchased the car without an engine, put mine in, and it was supposed to run with, you know, everything plugged up correctly, battery, you know, did all the, did all the right things I needed to do to get it to run, plugged up everything, and it didn't run. Turned the key, some relays clicked, but started in turnover. All the wiring looked legit, but it wasn't legit at all. So I decided to look up this schematic from this website that pretty much allows you to put a KA inside of any car. If you can see that, I don't know if it's focused or not, but you know, if you can just see the outlines, if it's blurry, you know, one, two, three relays, four fuses, you know, that's pretty much what I got hooked up right here. You know, I got everything hooked up. When I turn the key, I'd show you guys if my battery wasn't, you know, dumb dead, but all the relays click when I turn the key. You know, here's my EFI relay. I think this one's my fuel pump. One of these two are my fuel pump, and the other one's the ignition. And then this one is uh, power to my EFI relay when I turn the key because some wires, you know, I had to find certain wires that turned on when I turned the starter, and I had to find some wires that are always on, even with the car in the off position, and then certain wires that turn on and off in certain positions and blah, blah, blah. But, you know, I, I got that hooked up. I can't even test it because the dude also forgot to tell me that the fuel pump was dead. You know, I found that out. I found a power wire in the car, hooked it up to the fuel pump. And, you know, I tested the, the connection to the fuel pump from that wire. And, you know, the wire was getting power. And then I grounded the fuel pump out and then nothing happened to the fuel pump. You know, it wouldn't turn on and hear any noise or nothing. You know, I would at least like to have heard some type of broken noise, but I didn't hear anything. So, fuel pump's dead. And I decided to buy a fuel pump off of eBay for like 20 bucks. You know, I really don't care that it's a cheap fuel pump. I just need a fuel pump that I know is going to work. You know, I'm going to hook it up, ground it out, see if it works, put it in the car, turn the key, hopefully it starts. But, you know, you guys are going to be here witnessing firsthand if these four relays can make this car start. And if it works, go out, buy a KA, buy a car without an engine, figure out the wiring, and you can put your KA inside of anything. Hashtag put your KA inside of anything.com. <laughs> that's not the name of the website, but, you know, that's, uh, that's what I would call it. But anyway. I got gypped so bad with this car. I gave the dude 600 bucks for a car that didn't work. Oh, and the brakes don't even work. Well, like two brakes work, but the front brakes don't work. The rear brakes do. But, yo, this car, man, I thought this car was going to run when I bought it. Nothing happened when I hooked up everything. So I just, you know, I know it, it had the, uh, the dude's harness in it still when I got it. So I was like, oh, man, it has to run. You know, I really believed what he said, you know, because when I went to the dude's house, he had two SRs on engine stands. He was rebuilding two SRs. So I was like, oh, this guy does 240s, you know. This is a true 240 head. And it comes down to it that this dude just sold me garbage because he couldn't get the car to run. But I got the start of the turnover. I got the relays to click with this, you know, spontaneous KA, put it in, your, put it in any car wiring. Really don't know if it works, but I got it wired up right. All the relays click in the you know in the appropriate order, so hopefully that works. Dang, my arm's tired. <laughs> but you guys are gonna witness firsthand, like I said, if this car is gonna run. Once my fuel pump comes in, I'm gonna you know video that, video that, videotape that, put that up, so you guys can witness this car freaking running. Cause I'm sick and tired, you know, of this car just sitting here not doing anything. I mean, I've been working on it for about two weeks already. I had the car for a while, but I didn't have the means to actually start working on it, but, you know, you guys see, I've been working on it, you know, I hooked it up to the dude's hop, to the dude, to the dude's wiring, his wiring was not, you know, was so adequate, even though the dude has a freaking license from Lincoln Tech, you know, to work on cars and crap, but I guess that doesn't mean anything anymore, a certificate, but I got 
stuff going on that the dude couldn't even, you know, get work in when he had it. So I'm pretty proud of myself for that. And, you know, hopefully when I get this fuel pump in, everything's going to work, you know. Like I said, I'm just I'm tired of this car just sitting here. I'm ready to slide this thing. And when this car is running, wherever you guys are at, I'm coming to you. We're going to slide. If you want to slide with me, come here. I live near English Town. Well, I don't live near English Town, but English Town is a pretty good drive away from me. And I will make that drive every weekend if I wanted to. And, you know, just when this car is running, we're going to slide. I don't care who you are, male, female, tranny. I don't care if you got a car with LSD or if you got an open diff and you just want to slide, come to me, man. We're going to freaking slide. Come to lady, man, man, lady, who cares? We're going to freaking slide. You know, I'm just, I just want this car to turn out. This is my only car I got right now. So this is, this is what I got going on for me. You know, just stay tuned for the fuel pump coming in. I'm going to be up trying to upload, I'm going to try to upload as many videos as I can, you know, but you know, when the fuel pump comes in, be on the lookout for that video. My name is Two for T. And have a nice day.